Yo guys, it's HD here, and today, doing another video. <laughs> Oh, thanks. Anyway, uh, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to rank up fast in Infinite Warfare. Ain't that right, Raheem? Yeah. <laughs> Something wrong with you. But, anyway, um, so, uh, the reason why you want to rank up fast is you want to get to prestige as quick as you can, because when you get to prestige, you get two unlocked tokens. Uh, one for, like, the normal weapons, so just the weapons you want to carry over into your prestige. And the other is for the classic weapons, which are, the, obviously, the OSA, the max have... <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, the Mac Tav 45, the TF or the Intervention, the S Ravage and the M1. Um, obviously, everyone wants all of the guns, but it's going to take you pretty much so one, two, three, four, until the fifth prestige to get them all. Um, so the um, so I'm going to show you. So I'm going to show you about eight eight different um, like tips to rank up fast. Okay, so the first one is the mission street mission team. So this is the new thing in, implemented into Infinite Warfare. Can you stop making it? Shut up! Shut up! Sorry. Uh, so this is the new thing that's put into Infinite Warfare, and it's obviously the mission team. So um, there's four missions to uh, pick, and you want to just stick with the first team until you complete all of the. So until you get to level forty, is it? No, it's fifty. Until you get to level 50. Um, so the, the quickest way to do this is just in the challenges. You want to obviously, so there's four steps in the challenges. One, doing the completion of it. And then you get bronze for, so say if it's the first one to get five kills, next one will be get 10 kills, then it'll be 15 kills. No, sorry, it's 15 kills, 20 kills, 25 kills, I think. Might be wrong, but I think it's that. But. Um, yeah, so you you, um, always, you want to always go for the mission, so every game you want to make sure you pick the mission that you're able to complete and just go for that. Uh, go for getting gold and that because that will be the quickest way to um, to uh, level up your obviously, mission team and obviously you get bonus XP for that and also you get salvage. So like you, you need a lot of salvage because like, it's 4,000 for an elite weapon and that's quite a lot. Means, like I've only got like 400. But yeah, so it takes a long while to... Um, get that anyway so that's just another bonus and then also so into the game modes if you're playing solo you want to play kill confirmed or hard point um there so kill confirmed obviously you get so 50 kills for a kill 75 kills for picking up the medal or 50 points for denying one and then also when you get a kill or when you die no, so when you get a kill but don't pick up the medal, you get 25 points for that. So, you know, there's a lot of XP. And what what, what, what you want to rock are for the uh, score street, you want to put on UAV and count UAV. If you can, just put on these two, because then you're just constantly getting UAV, count UAV. It's literally like three... No, I think it's like five. It depend, depends what, obviously, um, perk you got on, but I think it's five kills for a counter UAV. I think... Um, on I was killed confirmed. It depends what game mode and everything, but um, and then if you got more players, you want to play ground war and domination and the hard point as well. Um, uh, obviously, these are the best for XP. Obviously, um, you 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 get more um, XP for obviously doing the see so the flags and the hard point and stuff. And then ground war, there's just a lot more players, so obviously you're gonna get more kills along the games as well. So that's just, they're just the best game modes for. XP and stuff, and then also you want to win the game. Like wh when you win, you, you get a double match bonus as when you lose. Um, so obviously that's going to make a massive difference to whether le oh, uh, le leveling up. If you obviously lose every game, it's going to take you double the time technically uh, to level up. Where if you obviously winning all the games, so you want to always go for the win. So make sure you play with lots of players. Well, you lots lots of your mates. So uh, and you want to just grind for the win basically, and then you want to grind for. Um, the camo challenges. Now, most of the challenges you just get like a few XP, but but eventually, when you get, if you can get to the gold camo, uh, camo that's ten thousand XP. That's a lot of XP. That depending on what level that you are, that would put you uh, either level or a couple of levels. Um, but yeah, you want to make sure you try and get the gold camo. Um, 
start with the SMGs because they are the easiest because you only need, you don't need like headshots or anything, you just need sliding kills, jumping kills, hit fire kills and stuff like that. So they're a lot easier than assault rifles as you, obviously the headshots are, a, that, they're, they're quite one of the hardest things to do. Um, and then you want to use different combat rigs, comp complete other challenges for them. So if you go into the barracks, obviously there's different challenges for different combat rigs. You want to try and complete as many of them as you can. Obviously because you get bonus XP for everyone you complete and obviously you, you get the cool little like, uh, the, so you can change the head, the body and the stuff, so you get them as well, but that's a little bonus. Um, and then also, you want to look at your challenges in your barracks. Um, obviously, you have, like, I think there's about a hundred different challenges. There might be more, I'm not sure. But there's lots of different challenges. Just go for the ones that you're closest to. So, you know, there might be like, I think there's like SMG kills, assault rifle kills, stuff like that. So, some that you just get by like, playing the game, but you want to go for, obviously, the ones that you're closest to, because that's going to uh, make sure that you get the most XP. So yeah, make sure you go for them, and soon you'll be prestige in no time, getting all them, uh, you know, obviously the classic weapons and stuff. So, uh, just use all these tips and you'll be ranking up super, super fast. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the video, and if you did, obviously another thing, obviously you just want to get lots of kills, but obviously not, not everyone can do that, but yeah. Uh, but anyway, I hope you did enjoy the video, and if you did, make sure you smash the like button, and if you're new around here, make sure you hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Oh, but by the way, sorry about, like, yesterday's video, the stuff went wrong with, like, uploading stuff. That's why it went out so late. It technically went out today, but obviously that was yesterday's video, so. Anyway, I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Uh, peace.